guys I am here to do a book review for you and the book I'm going to be reviewing today is my life next door by Huntley Fitzpatrick so this book is about a girl named Samantha Reed and her mother is a very wealthy prestigious rule abiding state senator and she lives next door to the Garretts who are completely opposite of what her mother thinks appropriate. They have five or six kids. They are always messy, dirty, loud, you know, everything that she is not. And so she's always grown up with the idea that the Garretts are disgusting and not um, like self-control with the, all their kids. And so she has always grown up to stay away. But for some reason she finds them fascinating because she feels her mother is kind of absent in the relationship. So she's always kind of watching them and she sits on her roof and kind of eyes them throughout the years. And she really grows to be very um, interested in this family. So one night she is, of course, on her roof watching them and she meets Jace and Jace is, I think, one of the eldest, he's the second or third oldest in the Garrett clan, and they start to talk and they end up falling in love, and it's just a story about how society, um, you know, considers rich families and more not rich families, poorer families, and it's basically just a story of her mother not accepting her relationship with Jace and about her best friend's brother's struggle with addiction, her best friend's struggle with perfectionism, and all of those traits that just hit home so hard. I personally adored this book. I gave it a five out of five. I so enjoyed reading it. It was an easy read, very um, easy to get through, very laid out. The dialogue just flowed so beautifully. It was just like water, just gliding through water. And it was a beautiful, beautiful story. The analogies and metaphors were amazing in this book. There's so many just ones that I wanted to pinpoint and the humor was spot on. She knew exactly where to put it and I just fell in love with the characters as well. I loved Sam as a character. I loved Jace. I adored, adored Patsy and George. I mean, they are amazing. I would love to put them in my pocket. <laughs> and I loved the Garrett's family. And there is a hit and run involved in this book and I was constantly reading the pages because it was kind of towards the end of the book. So I was like, who's going to get hit? Like I could not picture who was going to get hit. And it was just a beautiful book. She tied everything in so perfectly. And there wasn't too much of the teenager angst, which I really enjoyed. And it was really refreshing to get away from that for a little bit and then come back. But the book was beautiful. I loved it so much. It was such a silent horse in the race because I hadn't heard much about it. Then again, I was off YouTube, but I haven't heard much about it. It was kind of staying low on the radar. And then a couple people recommended it to me and I got it and I fell in love. I read it in like two days and I just couldn't put it down and it was between testing. And so I was reading, I told myself I could read for like 10 minutes if I studied for an hour. And so that's just how I got it done. I brought it to the gym with me, everything. Like this book went wherever I went. I loved it that much. So like I said, guys, I gave this book a five out of five stars. Please go read it. It's lovely, lovely read. The atmosphere is perfect for summer as we're getting into the fall kind of weather. It's perfect. Like you can just taste the summer. And I just wanted to hug all of the characters. They were so distinct and their personalities meshed horribly wonderfully together. And I really recommend you guys read this book if you have not yet. I Oh, it's one of my favorites of this year for sure. Not that I've read a lot this year, but it's definitely one of my favorites and probably will be a favorite for this year. So please, please go read it. It's really amazing. Okay, guys, that was my review. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found it informative. And if you decide that you did like this review, please comment below and let me know if you're going to read the book. If you have not yet, I really recommend that you do. And just feel free to leave comments and let me know how you guys are doing. And I will talk to you later. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.